What would happen to molecule if the universe were made up of something else? I am Baharia Kazuzi. I'm a civil engineer and I have been teaching and researching in Erfan Keihani Halqe training courses for more than a decade. The community of Erfan Keihani Halqe have conducted many experiments and case studies about the novel theories of Dr. Muhammad Ali Tahiri. Most of the activities were focused on improving functions of mind, size, and body of human. Some research were also focused on other living creatures, including animals, plants, and microorganisms. In 2011, I started researching on materials, cement in particular. Resistant and cancer of concrete. Concrete cancer is a destructive progressive expansion. The experiments showed that the consciousness fields can affect various subjects and are not restricted to any special division. This was an agreement to the theories of Erfan Keihani Halke, which will be introduced briefly. As it depicted, the consciousness fields can act as an interuniversal consciousness network or internet. Consciousness is neither matter nor energy. However, formation of matter and energy as well as the physical events and laws are derived from consciousness. Consciousness transform into matter and energy and vice versa. It is possible to transform matter and energy into consciousness. Energy is formed in the field of consciousness and without such a field there would be no energy. So the material universe does not have more than one dimension and what human perceives as a different dimension such as three-dimensional space and time or fourth dimension are meaningful in this field of consciousness and are in fact formed and created in this field of consciousness. It should be noted that the treatment and recovery include our drop shooting, recovery and repair programs of cells and related organs that are found in the interuniversal internet. And as mentioned, since all of the software programs of the existence part are available in this magnificent internet, we call it the interuniversal consciousness network. Therefore, for the interuniversal internet, it is not matter whether the cells belong to humans, animals, plants, or microorganisms, and throughout it, and when the effect on molecule is possible. So far, the behavior of cement under electric and magnetic fields has been tested in other studies. In this study, based on the aforementioned introduction, two sets of independent tests on cement were performed. In the process of fabricating the samples, they were all made by the laboratory personnel of Amir Kabir University of Technology, who had no knowledge of the fields. The samples were named randomly and completely differently with names having no particular meaning. All samples were made of a standard sand and tip to cement. First five sets of cement mortar were made, model based on a standard ISIR 393. One set as the control set and the other four sets under the influence of consciousness field. Then, at 7, 29, and 42 days of age, the compressive and flexural strength were measured. Moreover, four sets of samples were made to examine the alkali reaction of aggregates using the alkylated permistic mortar method based on a standard ASTMC 1260. The mortar mixing was done according to the standard ASTMC 305 equipments. The samples were put into the chambers immediately after modeling. Then, the chambers were placed in the oven at 80 plus and minus 2 degrees centigrade. After uh, 24 hours, the chambers were taken out of the oven, respectively. Then, baseline of each permeum was read immediately after drying their surface, and they were put back into the chambers with enough one normal NaOH to drown the samples. 
Expansion of the four samples for each cement and aggregate composition were reported for each of them and approximately 0.01% in the absorbed values. Results. One every seven days and uh, 42 days of age showed in, in, an increase in compressive strength of 6 and 15.6% respectively. Moreover, 6% increase in fluctual strength has been seen at 42 days of age. Moreover, in the alcoholic reaction assessed, three samples under the consciousness field influence had an average decrease of 7% in expansion, p-value equal 0.008. Cement has a basic hardening character and has become harder under the consciousness field. We have a lot of guesses about what can happen to molecule and atom and maybe quarks. In the first step, we tried physical behaviors of cement, such as better hardation or changes in the composition of elements, and we observe a lot of changes also in chemical structure under alkali reaction. The chemical compounds are different. Question, how far do these changes continue and can they affect the behavior of microcosmic even at the level of vibration of the strings? This research requires a new independent discipline with the task of explaining throughout definite frameworks, statics and probability. In the consciousness language and proving the non-physical or immaterial part of the universe in order to clarify that every motion in the universe is intelligent and it is not subject to probability. However, in reality it follows probability. In other words, Breathing the gap from the perspective of Erfan K. Hani Halger requires another discipline, the role of which is the study of the immaterial part of the universe, which is neither matter nor energy, subject of consciousness or intelligence, is at the heart of his study. Therefore, here we introduce, for the first time, the field of research on the immaterial part of the universe, called science fact. This new discipline explores the phenomena of the universe with two major approach. One, a study of the immaterial part of the universe, what is neither matter nor energy, such as intelligence, consciousness, life. Two, proof of the immaterial part of the universe, what cannot be defined neither matter nor energy, but can be assigned and can be proven by scientific criteria, such as the influence of the consciousness field on human, animal, plant, microorganisms, and cell and molecule. Theories are used to make sense of facts and it is experimental theories and the empirical and experimental information confirm them and show a predictable logical relationship they will be changed to the law. The theory of monostructural world has been the basic of Erfan K. Hanihalga activity for the past three decades and as seen Connection to the consciousness has been down throughout the consciousness field and its any section and a structure of the existence it works based on a number of sub theories. They are experienced, repeatable and constant and over years of usage and research they will be changed to the principle which are added to human science. Therefore, formation of the universe out of the consciousness based on Dr. Tahiri's specific interpretation as a fundamental theory is a scientific discovery, and it is functional branch or its sub-theories is a special part of science. The consciousness field is formed by human equipment such as an advanced mobile phone and materials and it is a fix or improvement in the material performance and consequently economic benefit. On the other hand, it is sometimes necessary for the mass production line to design some mechanism to apply the right and suitable consciousness field 
to the material in question. The consciousness field by itself is a scientific discovery. Laws of its function of human, animal, plants, cell, and matter are theories of how to influence them and the application of materials due to the economic impact can be a patent. However, like other fields, it is not visible and it is possible to apply it by human switching and it needs training and interesting at the end thank you all for your interest and attention i sincerely appreciate the conference official efforts providing such an opportunity in spite of the difficulties out of the pandemic my special thanks goes to dr Muhammad ali tahiri for his great impact on science as well as human improvement have a good time best regard